Okay, uh, game one. Shin and Daisy versus Abkul and Shon and Kel. This is a team that we've not seen too much, but the hell of day, they're doing it. Mostly because Abkul's teammate for the day, Rudra, is playing Smash 4, but we're gonna ignore that. And continue right along. Oh. Hole in one. <laughs> Oh, look at the peaches in the corner. The pittos. The most boring ditto in melee. Peach dittos. So, probably at any point in time, there's gonna be... Oof, lab smash. There's gonna be a peach well over 100%. But Fox and lab smash is not having it. That was such a sloppy recovery, but... He got away with it. They're getting pushed off stage, but the recovery is just unreal. And over on in Smash 4 that we're running, we have Rudra. Rocks and Rudra in Grand Finals for Smash 4, but back to melee, we have. Huh, the chase down but he missed the fourth match. There's such teamwork. So many minute interactions that you don't oh, that you can't that you don't always catch. Wow. Look at that, the runaway mail. And just like two characters playing together. It's just just so interesting to see two different people think and act. Move and wow, look, look at that. That was amazing. He saw it, he went for it. His partner was nowhere now, so there was no risk of his partner getting hurt. And he went for it, he got two kills. One up smash. Yeah, and now he had to pay VAT on them, on them double kills. Taking his stock. Oh, the double, the down smashes. Yeah, man, they charged me him. Once fully charged, it's not a joke. 25 percent. I say hit from getting off. Excellent down, excellent. Woo! Couldn't get a grab. He gets the forward smash. <laughs> a little bit of mid-match trash talk from Shonen Gal. He's on his last talk though, but he's putting in the work. Green team. I mean, uh, hold on, wait. Red team is in the lead. Green team is. The Fox from Red Team is on their last legs. Oh, but uh, unfortunate self-destruct. Wow, it turned around. Wow, we have we have a game. We've seen these two in Grand Finals so many different times. They've been know each other inside now, but we're gonna see how it plays out. If some, if Abku can get him off stage, you edge got him to hell and back. But Shin's on. Wow, I don't I don't know what type. Be reverse bro <laughs> pre brawl deck. No was but Oh yeah, he's pushing him off. He's going for it. That's it. Shin and Daisy. I mean uh I've cool and shown and Cal taking game one. So that's the first loss we've seen Shin and Daisy take all day. That's startling. Game two, Yoshi story. I wish you could have changed. Oh, clutch up smash. I wish you could have changed the music for melee. Like so much things from Brawl, even though Brawl was so vastly inferior in terms of gameplay, in terms of customization, character selection. Oh, and Brawl was definitely worse in terms of balance. <coughs> Man, like, what? Two things Brawl definitely got right was customization and character choice. There were more characters to choose from, and the skill gap wasn't necessarily as bad, except for Ganondorf. Brawl Ganondorf is trash, and he does not exist. 
in the heart of a Ganon man, such as myself. I man him in melee, I man him in Project M, but he does not exist in Brawl. Just some fat old guy, but an excellent charge shot. Oh, the juggles. Oh, carrying him across. Barely shielding that charge shot. He's letting him out very early instead of saving him and holding on to him. Maybe that's the secret for them winning game one, and that's going to help them here. I don't know if you guys noticed, but that shine from Shin sent absolutely nowhere. It's very strange. Edge got opportunity, but it's flopped. Shy guy cruising on by Randall. DBZ moment. I think everyone makes it back. Okay, both Peach is gone. Oh. He should have he known better. Angle down smash on Yoshi. Story stage. He really should have known better. Wow, good job waiting out the air dodge from Shin, but still didn't get that time. Hole in one. Good choice. Not even using his jump. Just immediately side me and grab the ledge. Fox, too good. Just these certain little things will make uh, other characters better than others. For example, Fox being able to grab the ledge with a side B. But Falco and Ganondorf. No, not Falco. Falcon and Ganondorf being unable to. These are the things that push characters ahead of each other. You could call it bad design, you could call it balance, but at the end of the day, it's mainly. And that's what makes Fox the best character in the game. Barely caught Randall. Pulling a turnip out of Randall. What type of video game is this where you can pull a turnip out of a cloud? I do think... Oh, the bullion. The bullion! The bullion! Okay, okay, yeah. He caught him with the, with the, with the survival DI and comboed him instead. Yeah. Alright, uh, game two goes to Apko and Shonikel as well. Seems we found a beast team here. A team that challenges Shin and Daisy. And the run back of the salt. Race your PJ salts. Ooh, Daisy in a wow, that's Daisy in a bad spot. She loses stock. You should see her face. She's in the zone. There's not a lot of things on earth that can match the intensity of a gamer's face when they're playing a serious match. Poor, poor standing, standing missile, but he doesn't get punished too bad. Oh, the down smashes are everywhere. Mm, slap that hole. Wow. Shona Kel was quick. He paid for that mistake, but we'll see how it, how it ends up in the long run. Down smash, flank. Samus. Samus with the stanky leg. Trying to catch someone. Up smash trade. Always in Fox's favor. Fox got that VAT on up smashes, man. It always ends up working out for him. Mm. The float cancel nails are insane by Sean and Jeff. Impeccable. Uh, it's, it's just impeccable float cancel nails by Sean and Kel. Tried to go for a turn and drop, but I think Shin's invincibility was still on. Wave shine up smash does not kill yet. Looking like Mango versus Armada. But as we know, Armada has. Wow, okay. Didn't even let me finish my boring joke. The double clanks. That Peach trying to stick her next hand up the next Peach dress. Woohoo! This game is heated, but we see that like the last two games, Red Team has is sustaining lead. Like that right there. Daisy was not able to punish and take the stock. Luckily a team may picked up for. But we're still seeing that, you know. Unless Red Team can Wow, we got another stock. Wow, okay. Unless Red Team makes a serious error, they're not losing their stocks early enough. I don't think their passive aggressive play style, the green teams, is working out for them this match. They need more aggression. They need to punish more edge, more recoveries. Wow. Daisy loses the stock, she's gonna have the not even able to borrow the stock in time. I think he went Whoop! We had to be him so I Jedi mind tricks. But that falling up here. We got Dart Maul in the building. He said he doesn't need the blade. He's gonna beat you with his force powers. That force up smash. Excellent dodge. Yeah. This Jedi can see into the future. He's stuck in his dodging, but stage spike. 
That's the third game. And that's that, ladies and gents.